Welcome, John Croner with Bullseye Trader. And I'd like to welcome you to the Artificial Intelligence Holly and Market Update for Tuesday, March the 26th, 2019. Well, let's take a look and see how these markets did today. We're going to go ahead and start with the spiders. And we can see here we had average volume of uh, you know 1.05%. And you can see on the volume bars here, nice and average. Uh, you know, we had that nice gap up to start the day out. You know, and, and then we pulled back, and then we, we got some back at the very end. Uh, you know, uh, we're, we're down. You, you can see that doji candle, so uh, yet another indecision candle, but uh, it, it's up from yesterday's indecision candle. So uh, it's getting very, very interesting here. But, uh, you know, uh, let's take a look at the other charts and see how they looked. Uh, here's the diamonds. And you can see uh, much the same uh, pattern. You know, we had the gap up and then the pullback, a little bit of an increase at the end, uh, just below average volume at 0.97. You can see the volume bars here. You can see the doji candle that we had, uh, you know, uh, you know, closed well off the highs, uh, you know, maybe about midpoint there. Uh, you know, so, uh, you know, let, let's see what happens uh, tomorrow and uh, let's take a look, see how the queues ended up. And here we go here with the cues, and we see uh, much of the same story again. We see the pattern just repeated over and over. 1.14 was the relative volume. You can see down here on the graph, you can see the doji candle there. So, uh, you know, uh, t tomorrow uh, could be an interesting day, as they all are. Now, with that, let's go ahead and move on into the uh, Holly and see how the three Hollies did. Holly Grill had three trades for a profit of four cents. Risk on profit, 77 cents. And we'll take a look here. We had SITE, uh, the uh, tailwind strategy. Uh, she got in uh, and uh, made 33 cents, got out for a profit save. And after she got out, it went on to make 80 cents had you held it till the end of the day. So, uh, you know, very nice trade uh, on a uh, day that didn't go too far. Uh, and we look at Holly 2.0, four trades for 83 cents profit, risk on profit of 44 cents. Her best trade was uh, MGTA. It was a pullback, uh, bullish pullback strategy. She got out once again for a profit save uh, and made 44 cents. But had you held till the end of the day, you would have lost 44 cents. So that one turned around big time. Uh, and I will point out as we're looking here, you know, all of the Hollies only had long strategies to choose from. There were no shorts in the hopper today. You know, when she went in and she ran all her calculations last night, none of them met the criteria for today. So, uh, you know, we, uh, you know, had no short strategies. Now, Holly Neo was definitely the more active one. We had 16 trades, but she lost $1.56. You know, and on the risk one, she lost 49 cents. So, you know, sometimes people tell you less is better. Well, here's a prime example of it. You know, look at this. We had three trades. We had four trades, and here we had 16. But on the uh, other charts here, we, we made money. But here where Holly Neal was very, very aggressive trading, 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 Overall, she ended up losing money. So uh, let's take a look and see what trades might have been good trades in here, though, for her. Uh, let me get this uh, get this cleared and click this. There we go. And her best trade was APY. It was the tailwind strategy. She got out for a profit save, $0.39. Cents. Had you held till the end of the day, it was a $0.43 cent profit. And her best trade was SITE. Uh, and 33 cents uh, with the 80 cents profit had you held till the end of the day. And I believe that was the same one we had yep, right up here. So that is your Holly uh, update. Now let's bring in the Excel spreadsheet so we can go ahead and get a look at that. And we see here overall we had 23 trades, lost 69 cents, but on the risk one we did make 75 cents. For the week we're sitting at 45 trades. A loss of 288 on the risk off, on the risk on, a loss of $1.15.